Hello. 2021. Woo! That was a very flashy intro. I like that. Um, Siren, I hope you're doing well. Oh, God, it's been so long. Let me see if I remember how to do all this. Um, there we go. Yes, yes, I do. Alright, so apparently the program has had a couple of adjustments since I last streamed. Um, so the sound seems a little low on my end. If anything needs to be adjusted, please let me know. Um, otherwise, let's just jump into it. Bioshock Infinite. <clears throat> just brightness. Oh, God, right. I kept my brightness settings from God of War because it was so dark. So now my TV is actually brighter than the stream. <laughs> Here, let's brighten it up a little bit. Use a slider to adjust your brightness to see Bioshock Infinite as intended. Please adjust blah, 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 until the middle square is barely visible. You know what? A little more brightness is better than under. So we'll save it there for now. <laughs> How you doing, Siren? Uh, say, there you go. Ah, two K makes me sad. <laughs> Why am I being shown this? Like, this is the disc from my Bioshock collection, so I don't know why it's advertising the Bioshock collection to me. <laughs> That's so weird. Looks, it sounds great. Um, well, I'm glad to hear that, but um, I'm wondering about the volume. It seems a little low to me, especially compared to what I remember from the last couple streams I did. Oops, ah, no worries. <laughs> I don't know. I guess we'll have to... I mean, right now it's supposed to be a background radio playing, so it's supposed to sound low. Um, okay. Well, just let me know if anything changes. Yeah, okay. Perfect. Um, audio, master volume... Dialogue subtitles, all right. Okay, big game. Yeah. Select the difficulty level for your new game, medium. If you know the basics of first person shooter games, then this is the best place for you to start. Very experienced with FPS games and enjoy a challenge. Nope. If you're new to FPS games and still want to control the action start here. Nope. Medium it is. Booker. 
Are you afraid of God? No. But I'm afraid of you. The mind of the subject will desperately struggle to create memories where none exist. Barriers to trans-dimensional travel are Ludus 1889. 12, coast of Maine. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing? Not standing. Rowing. Rowing? Hadn't planned on it. So you expect me to shoulder What's the this? burden? No. But I do expect you to do all the rowing. And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do, no, but we're never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does. But there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. <laughs> We've arrived. Oh, there, see? All that complaining and you were literally seconds away. Climb ladder. Thanks, friends. Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? Would that change anything? It might give him some comfort. Oh, at least that's something we can agree on. Hey! Is somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Looks like there's someone inside. <laughs> so, I have played this before. This is not blind, so... Um... I do already know some of the intricacies of this game, the mysteries, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I'll be enjoying some of the weirder moments through the lens of knowing what's going to happen later in the game. I will imagine that a lot of that just seemed very strange to people, though. Um, Alright. So this is a prequel set in the 1920s, I believe. And this one is vastly different from its predecessors. We'll see why in a moment. Sure. Silver Eagle. Can of beans. Sure. Coins in the cushion. Oh, we'll collect this, I guess. Bring us the girl and wipe away the dead. Booker DeWitt. I guess you're expecting me. This is your last chance. So. Oh. I'll take that. God, this is gonna take some getting used to. <laughs> Sin, shall I wash thee? Sure! There's our lovely face. Good luck with that, pal. <laughs> so, if anyone doesn't recognize that voice, that is uh, Troy Break Baker, who uh, is also Joel from The Last of Us. Is anyone here? Hello? Sure! I mean, he didn't actually dial anything, so I can't say I'm surprised it didn't work. Be prepared. He's on his way. You must stop him. See. Wallet? Ooh, yes, please. Don't need to 
use the sink. Siren, is it safe to say that you're preoccupied right now? Oh, lovely! Don't disappoint us. Single shot to the head. Ew. Alright. I'll need a pair. Why not? God, this has been so long since I played this. This is so bizarre. <laughs> Save. It auto saves. Okay. Use bells. Ah, not yet. Gee, I wonder what it wants me to do. Okay, scroll times one, key times two, knife times two. Oh, there we go. The sky is making music for us. That's quite the observation. <laughs> so, uh, what the hell? Yeah. Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. The bindings are there as a safeguard. No, no, God damn it! Attention. <laughs> Ascension in the count of five. No, count of four. No, no, no. Three. Two. One. No. Ascension. Ascension. Five thousand feet. Ten thousand feet. Fifteen thousand feet. Bam! Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> City in the sky. That's like a Fallout leaving, the, like a Fallout character leaving the vault moment there. Well, we don't seem to be plummeting, Father Comstock. Our prophet. Nice and gentle. Written in the clouds. Why would he send his savior unto us if we will not raise a finger for our own salvation? Though we deserve not his mercy. He has led us to this new Eden. A last chance for redemption. So yeah, this is definitely radically different from the first two Bioshock games. Instead of going to an underwater city, you're going to a floating one. 
And the prophet shall lead the people to a new Eden. I'm guessing that's Comstock. Oh, my health bar is so tiny! goes. <laughs> There's definitely worse ways to fly. Especially since flying wasn't really a thing in the 20s. Not like that, anyway, especially. No, save You're fishing. No worries, sir. It's okay. Oh, oh god. Mostly food, actually. <laughs> Cookies and stuff like that. But, I mean, not a lot. It's... Uh, mostly because you, it's, it's hard to interact with, you know, family and friends and whatnot during the pandemic and whatnot, so... It was still a very good Christmas. I am by no means complaining. How about you? The seat of the prophet shall sit the throne and drown in flame the mountains of man. Well, this is definitely like a radical change too from most games that just throw you in the action without any context. This is like a very peaceful, calm, soothing intro. There's nice, delicate candlelight here to set the ambiance. The welcome center. Excuse me, where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. No follow-up questions? You're just gonna leave it like that? Alright. <laughs> just keep such questions to myself, unless I want to get made. Ow! Oh, okay. Alright! Fair enough. The Lamb. The future of our city. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, Boy Scout toy, okay. I thought it was supposed to be some sort of, like, Vault Boy kind of thing, but uh, I don't think so. I don't know, I don't want to be taking money off the... Donation plate. <laughs> so I'm just gonna leave that. Search fiddle case. Oh. Can't go wrong with cookies. I. You're telling me. <laughs> it's quiet. Yeah. Most people had a quiet holiday, but all right. That's not charity. Again, it's unfortunate, but it could have been a lot worse, right? I still consider it a good Christmas. Hey, Batito! All aboard the Panda Express. <laughs> How are you doing today? Okay, that's good. Alright, let's see what's on the other side here. With this lighting, this looks... It kind of reminds me a little bit of, like, the, um... The Little Sisters, for some reason. This is just money, basically. Yeah, it's just money. Ooh. Vaxophone, okay. So anybody that remembers anything from the first games, they had um, audio tapes. This is this game's version of those tapes. Um, instead of like a little 
cassette tape. You have basically a portable record player. <laughs> so, and it comes distinct with the, uh, the, 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 the sounds that it makes, like it's playing the record. It's so cool. So let's listen. Love the prophet because he loves the sinner. Love the sinner because he is you. Without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? Without sin, what grace has forgiveness? Like, it's got that scratchy quality to it. It's really cool. Alright, Lady Comstock, sure. Lurking and such, I appreciate that. I hope you're doing well. Alright, bye, friend. Went down. And every year, on this day God. of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Thompson. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves in the sweet waters of baptism. Oh God, are we about to get baptized right now? If the prophet has struck down our enemies at wounded knee and not railed against the Sodom beneath us, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just railed against the Sodom beneath us, but not accept the three golden gifts of the founders, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just accepted the three golden gifts of the founders and not prayed for our deliverance, it would have been enough. If the prophet had only prayed for our deliverance and not led us to this new Eden, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just led us to the new Eden and not purged the vipers of the Orient, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just purged the vipers of the Orient, but not suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, it would have been enough. If the prophet had just suffered the sacrifice of his beloved, but not expelled the Vox Populi, it would have been enough! Well, that was passionate. And... Now it's just impressed. I feel like I gotta go that way. Am I supposed to push past people? It's funny, because Booker's afraid of getting made, as he said, but, um... He kind of stands out. Everyone here is in white. Alright, let's... Yeah. Is it someone new? Someone from the Sodom below? Newly come to Columbia to be washed clean? Before our prophet, our founders, and our lord. I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. <laughs> Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Hey, I'm just looking to pass through. Praise go be on, brother. Be Glory be gone, brother. <laughs> All right. Glory be Here we go. Take his <laughs> hey. I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. What? <laughs> What do you want? We have a deal to it. Open this door right now. I told you. I'm not gonna do it. Go away. Mr. DeWitt. Mr. DeWitt! Oh, we can move. We had a great break. Yes, I did. Thank you. Um, brother, all right, Hulk Hogan. <laughs> Yes, I have played this before. Um, I, I have played all of the Bioshocks, so none of it is new to me. Um, 
I've only played and beaten this once. So, while I remember the gist of the story, uh, there's probably going to be some elements that I don't remember. Um, but, for the most part, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll know what's going on. Alright, there's nothing to interact with, so I guess I'll just answer the door. Oh. Well, that was a lovely scene. <laughs> oh, it's keys, okay. That idiot priest needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and drowning one. I need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am. Locate the statue of Columbia. So Father Franklin with the key. Alright. Father Washington with the sword. And Father Jefferson with... Oh, the scroll. Yeah, okay. Alright. Despite not being American, being American, um, I do get the symbolism there. Okay, friend. He who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and wings of angels. Watch over me. And let me stray the sword. And the chance, no luck. This is a lovely place. Just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. All right. So we got a girl to find. All right, we're going there in a minute. Uh, I guess there's no secrets to be had. All right, I guess we'll go now. This is the only one. Oh, you have played this. Um, did you beat it? Trippy. Hot dogs. Just wait. Did I lose health because the guy nearly drowned me? Morning. Good to see. That increased my health, apparently. I like how Buddy did not care. Oh, bug. Oh, there we go. I saw the change that time. Perfect day for the celebration. Well, there's a statue, I'm guessing. On the holy forgiveness of our dear lady Comstock, our beloved mother of forgiveness. I can interact with you, okay. That statue. I think it fails to capture to Father Comstock's past. There's no room for preference. Comstock's all right, I tell you. He says he's free, family, and fatherland. Who could be against all that? Sure, let's go up here. Oh my god. I actually forgot about the music. Never hire an artist, my dear fellow. They are a temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. Uh -huh. I told him that the park is exceedingly far behind schedule. The, the, the landscaping is half finished. The, the statuary hasn't arrived. The fountain is full of rainwater, for God's sake. Even the marigolds are still unplanted. All right. And then the archangel showed a vision. A city. Lighter than air. I asked her, why do you show this to me, Archangel? I'm not a strong man. I'm not a righteous man. I am not a holy man. And she told me the most remarkable thing. You're right, Prophet. But if grace is within the grasp of one such as you, how can anyone else not see it in themselves? Uh, so 
Zabek and I took turns playing until we beat it. Oh, nice! What were your thoughts? Now, what does Fox Popular even mean by heaven's sake? Uh, it's Latin. It means. Latin. <laughs> Eat cheese. Who doesn't like cheese? Alright. Um, I guess I'm supposed to go towards the bells. That is one leaky hydrant. Oh, that's something you don't see every day. Oh, it's mechanical, that's why. That's cool. Columbia Raffle Affair. That wasn't a very large parade, but we got the gist of it. Columbia Raffle and Fair. Huh. He's strong at the sword, but a bit weak at the key and the scroll, if you get my meaning. Yeah, I did see something shining over here. And there's nothing in it, of course not. And light variable winds throughout oh, the afternoon. In short, a beautiful day for the festivities, Columbia. You are on your now, honor. Put money in basket. Found us, bless you. Oh, I'm not gonna take money. It's the honor system. Pick up health again. Alright, this is just for provisions and health. Is this girl? She's the lamb! Weren't you paying attention? Oh my god, a barbershop quartet! <laughs> That kind of talk draws attention. Oh, don't turn into some faint and radical. Oh, that's where they oh. find her. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Huh. Telegram for you, sir. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence. Stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77. Stop. Lutex. Go to Monument Island and find the girl. Not pick lot My good day to you, sir. Hello. No. Hello. Fine day to you. I agree. I keep Would saying. You me? Should we if go I in? Told you a man could hoist a life with vigor is a life that's bigger. <laughs> Would you believe me? So vigors well, are the friend, plasmids from the first and second game. Those are no flights of fancy. Those are no tall tales told behind the pool hall. No, sir. No, ma'am. Those are figures <laughs> I'm That's talking what she said. about. Brought to you courtesy of Mr. I don't like it here. Where's Dr. Steinman? <laughs> Who amongst you He's alive somewhere down below. Gift of the Committing to his art, I guess. It's good till the end, then crazy. Yeah, yeah. Uh, sorry, give me one second here. 
I need to change something. Nope, that won't work. Oh god, I don't know. Um, sorry, I'm just changing the... So, no, that changed nothing. Oh, yeah, okay, that's, that's... Okay, fine. Sorry, it's, it's hard to understand what I'm doing when you can't see what I'm trying to adjust. Um, just the chat window on mine looks really bizarre, and I'm trying to fix it, and I'm actually making it worse. So I'm just going to leave it alone. One swing, and feats of wonder at the tips of your fingers. Okay, you so it's too early to get our first figure, obviously. You That's just showing time. off that they're there. And he has asked, first... Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Oh! Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is oh. just the ticket. Oh! We do get it. Play Cast Out the Devil. Here. Find the devil, good sir, and cast him out. Do you have what it takes? Whether you need to lift the woman and child, hit the devil three times. Bronco is just the ticket. Oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> Am I just raising them in the air? And that's three. We have a winner. Here you go, friend. And remember, if you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is your answer. Okay. So we got our... Oh, no, we didn't. We didn't actually get... We're, we were using a Vigor, but we didn't actually take it. We don't have the ability. So... $375. I have 34 <laughs> I will not be buying that today. Record your own Foxophone. Foxophone, yes. From the past in the present. Say something, Sonny. What's a Voxophone? What's a Voxophone? Exactly that. A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. <laughs> That's a good way to introduce it if you hadn't figured it out yet. I usually wait till Fink works out the kinks. So, oh. So you never played the first ones. Have you watched it then, sir? Save the day and win the prize. Here's the air rifle. Well, here's a brave fellow. Now, shoot the box when they appear. Target some points. And you'll you win a prize. Roy I'll even Roy throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. Oh, God. Uh. Well done, sir. Another shot right on the money. You're almost there. Well done, sir. There she is, Daisy Fitzroy. Fitzroy once again slips the noose. Oh god, I'm so bad at aiming in this. Alright, well that was fine, but time to move on. I like the world, world burning here. Whoa! I feel like this is a boss later in the game. Step right up and 
see the eighth wonder of the world. He's big. He's no, I'm good. He's the amazing handyman. Let's get out of here. He looks so sad. So sad. You're that strong. What's there to be sad about? Ah, uh, that's the replenisher. Figures. Have you ever lost a penny to a vending machine? Has a pay telephone ever refused to connect you with a beloved spouse? Well, it's time to take back control from the men of metal. With possession, you are the master. You will bend any machine to your will. I do like that. I one of those. With just a whisper, they're all ears. Oh, there we go. So this is our first figure, then. <laughs> oh, God! Machines into allies. <laughs> the old school demonstration videos. I forgot about that. With possession equipped, press L2 to make a machine friendly to you. wonder if it's permanent or not. Where's the aim assist? There is no aim assist. I, I don't know. <laughs> there might be. Nice acid trip. I don't know. That seemed pretty tame. What the hell was that? <laughs> Use projector. Oh, it's just that. Okay. Salts, yeah, okay. Alright, let's buy a ticket. Sorry, pal. The raffle is all sold out. Oh. Well, if it isn't a Zeblin in Buford, your spot at the raffle awaits. Don't know why I didn't recognize you before. Heads. Or tails. Come on, let me through. Heads. Or tails. It's weird that he's not questioning why these two are here. These are the same two that were in the boat earlier. Heads. Told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. Whoa! <laughs> That's a lot of heads. She said. Oh, okay. Uh, was that for me talking about heads? <laughs> I don't actually remember exactly what I said. Power for figures, restore self. So this is just restorative. So the equivalent of our first day machine, basically, in the first game. First two games. <laughs> he looks just fine to me. Mary, you are a living, walking scandal. <laughs> living, walking scandal. <laughs> Back in five minutes. Here we go. This is more like it. Get some balloons going on. The whole division got them. We're gonna flush the box out of the skyline system. What just happened? Lutus gave Columbia her wings. So apparently this is the person that sent us the telegram earlier. Madam Lutus, I have read 
all your books on the sciences. Mama says it's not a fit occupation for a lady, but I think she's jealous of our cleverness. Is it true that only you were allowed to visit the girl in the tower? If the lamb is lonely too, I should like to meet her, as we would have much in common. Warmest regards, Constance. A lot of head, yeah, okay. <laughs> Literally, like right after I said it, I forgot exactly what I said. So. <laughs> you shall know the false shepherd by his mark. I thought I remember there being a mark that differentiated him. I didn't realize it was just letters. I don't remember the context for that. Jeremiah Fink wants you to attend the July 6th raffle. Oh god. The rails. I am so bad at riding those. Thankfully that's not a thing yet. It'll come later. Oh, it's a turret system, I see. Okay. We'll see about that. I'm feeling lucky. You always got feeling lucky. This is it. This is it. I feel like I've waited all year for this. So I guess this is like their Christmas. Oh, this is that. Okay. What is this called? Different vending bots have different appearances based on what they sell, so... Okay, this isn't the 20s. This is the 10s. Oh, you're gonna force me to pick. That's right. I remember this. All right. Sorry. No sale. <laughs> Silly. There's never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? 77. 77. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me the bowl! Is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of Colombia? <laughs> all right then. The winner is number 77. Oh, what do you know? Over here. Over here. He's the winner. Number 77, come and claim your prize. First throw. Are you gonna throw it, or are you taking your coffee black these days? <laughs> go, I know what you want. Oh, looks like we've got a shy one here. Um, <laughs> we've got to do something. Oh, we can throw it at the announcer. Yes, please. Time to so waste him. Wait, <laughs> it's him. <laughs> now. Where'd you get that brand, boy? Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? The false shepherd? And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show them what we got planned, boys! Fight your way to Monument Island. All right, well that went from zero to a hundred real quick. When you see a skull on the enemy, you can hold a triangle to finish them. Okay. I 
industrial accident. Oh god. Oh my god! Search corpse. Yes! All the monies. Ow. Oh, alright, that works. Oh, I took his friggin' head off! Yes, cover the- ow! That's just rude. Let me punch you in the face! And we got a gun. Press R2 to fire your weapon. Oh god, the iron sights works the same way as the earlier Bioshocks, I forgot about that. Wait, was there something over here? Oh. Barricades! Alright, fair enough. That blackface thing in the background made me uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of different themes along those lines. It, I remember when they first released the game, they said that it's, it's not a focus of the game to include that stuff or to bring attention to it, but... It's symptomatic of the times, and to ignore it just would not be honest to the uh, the way of thinking, I guess, back then. I don't know how to word it, but... I told you, Comstock. You sell them paradise, and the customers expect cherubs for every chore. <laughs> no menials in God's kingdom. <laughs> well, I have a man in Georgia who leases us as many Negro convicts as you can board. Why, you can say they're simple souls in penance for rising above their station. <laughs> Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. Oh, this guy's a douche. All right. Possession aid. Adds ability to possess humans who was suicide when the effect expires. So I guess these are like our tonics? Possession now turns machine and man into allies. Hold and release to create a ghostly trap. Oh, that's cool. Press L2 to turn machines or people into allies. Hold and press L2 to make a position. Okay. Alright, so they did away with that. Bitches in the park. Cut him off! Don't let him Oh, that's pistol ammo. Oh, okay. I don't think that's conducive to maintaining a low profile. <laughs> so let's do it again! Get over here. Let me punch you in the head with this thing. There we go. Okay, 
so it is a regular vending machine. It's not just. Oh, ow! Stop it! At least we got some cotton candy out of it, I guess. to the throw a fire grenade. Okay, yeah, it's just gonna decide. I will take that, thank you. Yeah, here we go. Ah, full health. Whoa, 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 okay, all right. Dang it! Where are you? before, but it's been a while. <laughs> and I'm more used to the mechanics of the first couple of games anyways. They change things 
um, different enough for this one. Is there anything else up here that I missed? Popcorn, first aid. Which... Was I that low or did it do that little? Alright. Oh! Wait, 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 wait. Oh. I mean, I'll still take it. I ain't complaining. I don't know why I thought that'd be a secret. version of a confirmation. <laughs> Comstock Center rooftops. They have my sense if I can. <laughs> Drink soda pop. Sure. Unknown booze. That's actually kind of cool. Plus health, minus salt. I wish they made it a little more prominent than that. Oh, that is a lot! Dang! Okay, so only use that in a pinch if you're about to die. Gotcha. Season pass awarded you four gear pieces. A golden machine gun upgrade and a golden piss. I don't care about your crap. Just for revolution, awarded you 500 silver eagles and three... I'm guessing this is DLC stuff. You must collect all of your rewards before continuing the Monument Island. I don't want all the rewards. It's cheating. Use kinetoscope. I just paid money. Look back at opening day. 1893, the dream of the prophet is finally something. Columbia begins her journey to spread America's vision to the world. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're done. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, this is all the crap that they're talking about. Indeed. Why are you following us? We were already here. Why are you following us? I'm a thief. Oh, is that my shield? The difference between life and death. Yes, as a magnetic repulsive shield to improve defense. What was that? Surprising. Surprising that it worked? Surprising that it didn't kill him. But a magnetic repulsive field around one's body can come in handy. If it doesn't kill you. A fair point. <laughs> Alright, so now we have a shield ability. I do not want any of this crap. Go away. I am not taking that again. are going to make me do this, aren't you? No! I told you, Comstock. You sell them 
paradise, and the customers expect cherubs for every chore. <laughs> no menials in God's kingdom. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Don't want well, it. Well, I have a man in Georgia who leases us as many Negro convicts as you can board. I want this Why, guy to stop talking. I hate it when you accidentally activate them. In penance for rising above their station. <laughs> Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. Oh, that is so lame. Why does the game force you to take all this crap? I don't want it. Hey, Slothy. Where are we at here? We're water and father's also known as Daddy Hoo Boo. <laughs> this looks nice. It does. I mean, it was a pretty game back in its day on the PS3 as well, but... Um, it got real good treatment porting it over to the uh, PlayStation 4 as well. There's people alive in Bioshock? What? I mean, technically there were people that were alive in the first two games as well. They were just spliced up to the point where they were basically insane. I can't kill them. <laughs> I... You missed. <laughs> you find the going tough enough without squandering your friends? Or your ammunition. There you go. <laughs> oh, I hear a phone. What happened to the phone? There's gotta be a way to get through this without it turning into easy mode. Alright, maybe I just have to... They're still glowing. Roar! Roar! The bigger gun. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna help, Slothy. How you doing, Skip? Fine, take the stupid gear. I'm not... Monument Island. Gear. Equip item. Oh, these are all our weapons, I guess. We don't have any of them, but yay. Uh, okay. Whereas, yeah, Possession doesn't have its upgrade. That's weird. Box of phones. Take care. seen a game force its crap on you. I mean, that's not true, I guess. Oh my god. <laughs> I sure doesn't know. <laughs> Good try, though, but no. Slothy, thank you for the resub. <laughs> Slothy sub, yeah. I noticed that. I just saw the big block of... Slothy, thank you. That's awesome. And, hey, it's been a year. That means, yeah, you've got your one-year badge. One year of... Re no, I can't do it. Slothy is the uh, king of the Rees. <sighs> Trash. 
dress for success because I got the wrong. So the only other games I can think of where it forces its crap on you is the Fallout DLCs, like Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas. But you have an inventory management system with those games. If you don't want them, you can literally dump everything so that you can start with your vanilla gear or just nothing at all if you choose. I can't do any, like, you have to have gear equipped as soon as you pick it up. I can't unequip it. All right, are you going to get out of the way now? And I own FF7R. What is life? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Unspoken. How are you doing this evening? Okay, I, I guess I gotta do this, as much as I hate it. Um, shield. Oh, we get the shoes, okay. Nice. my mind or is anyone else hearing the phone ring too? I don't know what the gold bar That seems like it would be a money thing. I'm not gonna worry about that. Look at the amount of upgrades. This is stupid. There, now she moves. <sighs> Annoyance. Siren! I forgot my sub went out. Just watched an ad. <laughs> Thank you for the resub. I appreciate that. And you got all the health back that you lost. <laughs> all the upgrades. What a cheater. Panda, I, Panda was forced... Or Panda got forced cheats on himself. That wasn't even proper English. That's how annoyed I am. <laughs> Bad siren. <laughs> uh, well, it was a good try, Slothy. <laughs> siren banned. <laughs> oh, God. You guys are too funny. <laughs> Father Comstock called on me today to write his biograph. Me. The man pays for exactly 100 pages in advance. Now, I'm half a Jew when I smell silver, so I say, I say, Father, your flock would pay for a thousand. You know, why settle for less? And then the prophet looks to me and says, 100 will suffice as I know how it ends. Okay. If I I must have missed something there because I don't know a hundred what. <laughs> Blood on the streets, and worse is the insult because today is the day that marks our secession from the Sodom below. You had one job. Booker. Oh. No! The damn hook must be magnetized. Yay! Bootleg Spider Man! <laughs> oh, that poor guy!
machine gun. Softly only slaps. <laughs> wow, he tried to get me to shoot the the person that was blocking my way, and I proved to him that I couldn't, and the game commented on it, and I felt awkward. So, <laughs> well, now that Siren is banned, can I be stream boss? Sure, in almost fourteen hundred more HP. <laughs> Did you enjoy your break? It was very busy, but yes. It, it was busy and it was quiet at the same time. I I don't even know how it came about that way, but um, like I guess it was quiet compared to past years, obviously because of the pandemic. But it was still busy talking to the few people that are I was able to. So wait, what skip? <laughs> Thought that you were always stream boss. There you go. Canadians are busy. I know, right? Foreign concept. <laughs> How about you, Unspoken? How was your holiday? Ben, are you mad that I'm a three-day boy now? How could I possibly be mad that your schedule is basically similar to mine? <laughs> I'd be hashtag hypocritical panda if I were. Taming Moose said, What, Sloth? You're not supposed to tell people what I do on my Friday nights. That sounded a lot dirtier than I meant it. It feels a bit more intuitive. Like you, I feel like I can defend myself better in this game. Switch trash can. Sure. Why are people constantly throwing out money? I don't understand. I'll triple you. Well, that's just rude. Shield, recharge, there you go. Where is the friend who wants to cripple me? I hear him, but I don't see him. Death to you! Oh, alright. Oh! I guess punching them with a sky hook didn't kill them. I 
have no idea if I'm damaging this thing or what. I mean, it doesn't really look like I am. Oh, dang. Okay, there we go. Hashtag dirty piano 69. <laughs> Me never. Hashtag don't murder me. That's just rude. Christmas was pretty busy, but being off work for ten days was very nice. Oh, I, I imagine. Um, did you just like did they give you the two weeks off, or did you have to book it? I only had the the holidays themselves off, but I get my week coming up in a couple of weeks. I decided to take that on the same week as uh, my anniversary for streaming so that I don't, you know, die. <laughs> this gun looks like a stun gun. What's a stun? What? Did you mean like a stun gun or like a taser? Uh, you just said, yeah, yeet to that man. <laughs> Probably. I'm not murdering you. I'm saying you are a murder panda. Oh, okay. That's not true. As a citizen of the U.S., you guys, ha you know about your right to stand your ground. Don't try that. <laughs> oh, I just found a sweet tart stash. And it's empty. Is it really a sweet tart stash if it's empty then? <laughs> well, I'm sorry to hear that your stash didn't fulfill your needs. You murder cookies. That I can't deny. Do you like my cookies? Um. Do you guys in the States have, um. It's like a chocolate. It's similar to Junior Mints. Uh, they're called peppermint patties. Do you guys have that at all? Sten gun is a gun from World War II. Oh, okay. I am really bad when it comes to knowing my weaponry. Because I don't know. <laughs> I don't know anything like that. So, um, it, yeah, my ignorance is going to show through in that regard. You have one box left and it's juicy. All right. Well, I'm glad you found something. York. York mints. Okay, I haven't had them in years. But... York Peppermint Patty. Yeah, I think York is the brand, but they're called Peppermint Patty. Yeah. Um, so, somebody was telling me today that they know somebody who has a bakery uh, in a nearby town um, where they actually make cookies, like they're gourmet-style cookies, and one of the cookies that they make um, has embedded peppermint patties in it. And the way that they described it was just amazing. Um... And I want to try it. <laughs> like, I am a fan of mint chocolate chip. Anything? Am I able to hook onto this thing? Or... Am I going to die if I try? Or am I supposed to go... I guess I'm supposed to go down here? Nope. That was definitely not the play. All right. I'm supposed to go over when it's down, I see. Alright. Oh, I see you, Captain. You're mechanical, though. So you don't care if I ask you to help me. How do I... get in and ask it to help me? Or am I... Supposed, I guess I'm supposed to go over here. I think it was just loading while I was in midair there. Is this where I came from? No, I guess not. Okay. There we go. I 
thing again. Oh, oh, snap, okay. So I guess the possession is only temporary. Oh, there we go. I know a big boy is coming up. Like, oh. catch up real quick. Um, Klondike bars or die? Aren't those like the ice cream treats? They're not really the same thing. <laughs> I only know of it from video games. The York peppermint patties or 
I don't know what game they'd be in. Um, they're so good. I hate mint with chocolate. Yeah. Some people love them and some people do not. So it saddens me that you're one of the people that doesn't like them, but I get it. Um, it's more of an acquired taste. Are you a fan of orange chocolate or peanut butter and chocolate? I love Andy's mint chocolate. Yep, I agree. Perfect after dinner. And that one, honestly, um, if you're not a fan of mint chocolate because it tends to be overpowering, um, the Andy's chocolates, they are actually quite mild. So, in my experience, anyways. I haven't had them in a while either. But, um, but yeah, those are really good. Uh, cookies, gamble I must. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. You only gambled a little bit. That's all right. See, isn't it nice to be out in the sunlight in this game as opposed to the first two? <laughs> we're about, we're like in the clouds. Honestly, it is kind of cool. Yeah. Um, well, I can't, I can't say too much right now, though. We're still early in the story. Have you played this, Skip? I know the Sten gun. Oh, the Sten. Oh, okay. Oh my god, orange chocolate gets me around. <laughs> All right. It's not often I meet anybody that... Um, it's funny, because I was actually having this... The person I was talking to that they was telling me about the cookies, we were having this conversation. Um, it's not often that I meet anybody that enjoys orange chocolate, mint chocolate, and peanut butter chocolate, which I am a fan of all three. Um, the vast majority of everyone I've ever met and have, for some reason, had this discussion with, horribly dislikes at least one of those three. <clears throat> but yes, orange chocolate is amazing. I'm assuming you guys have Terry's in the States? Uh, cursed chocolate. <laughs> it's not cursed. I have, I love the chocolate oranges that you smack on the counter and it splits into, yeah, that's Terry's. Well, the, the popular one is Terry's. There's knockoff brands that do the same thing, too. They're so good. Oh my god. No, we are definitely somewhere new. Wild West show. Game Hunter of Legend. Alright. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna eat this hot dog and a coffee that was randomly sitting in a box. That's just going to reset my position. Wait. It wants me to go this way. <laughs> Alright. That's a fail on my part. Okay, so this is the museum. Fight the Serpent of Nation. Yeah, okay. So this is... We're gonna see, like, the Battle of Wounded Knee and stuff here. Look at this city, guys. Look, there's still fireworks going on, despite the fact that I'm here. And everyone hates the fact that I'm here. I got all non-DLC achievements on this game, except for the two related to 1999 mode. 1999 mode is the, um... Challenge based one, right? And also, I did a big Star Wars story, meaning two pages, because if I wrote more, I would not sleep, and I believe I did good on it. If I didn't, I'm a big, I'm be big sad. Don't be a big sad. Um, was this just like fan fiction, or is it like school related? I don't even remember, but there's one achievement for beating 1999 mode and one for beating it without using the bending machines. 
Which is the first ability I got, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure 1999 mode is, like, the challenge mode. Which I won't be doing. Um, you know me. I like my story-based DLC, and that's about it. obsessed with murdering or more specifically why is everyone in this game obsessed with murdering me can't we all just you know get along as they say game on hard I'm missing stuff again that homework so it's okay all right well, I mean, if you're happy with what you did, you should be fine. Uh, I beat the game on hard, though. And the only reason I can tell you all this is because I'm looking at the achievement list. <laughs> you don't remember much about it, but... <laughs> um, wow. I, I remember later in the game it can get pretty intense, especially if you don't know what you're doing. Um... Yeah, I've only played through the game once. Wait, your pistol is a... Uh, I'm going to mispronounce that, so I'm not going to try. Also used by the Germans in World War II. Yeah? I'll take your word for it. This is set in 1912. So... World War I hasn't even happened yet. Sting gun, I don't know who used that. Yeah, I can't obviously tell you. I remember nothing, but yeah, I'm a beast. <laughs> Not to toot your own horn or anything. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. Well, that just means you have to be a beast when it comes to uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake. Which, by the way, I am looking forward to watching tomorrow. I hope you're finding as much joy in it as I did. Order of the oh, Raven. For half a second, I thought it said ranch. Order of the ranch. I was very confused as to what that meant. Is that bird crap? It's totally bird crap. Is that it for money stashes? Looks like it. Okay. Oh, we're going to get a figure here, aren't we? I seem to remember sending crows out to attack people. Murderous crows, I think it's called. Oh. Protecting our race. Uh-huh. And we're back here. Stairs. I forgot the stairs. 
can't eat the pineapple. Fine, whatever. so satisfying to do. Ow. Alright. There you go. Okay. Oh, you're up here. Alright, I think main guy disappeared. So that means we'll have to fight him later, probably. Increasing my shield primarily because that's the regenerative portion of my health bar, basically. The actual health health doesn't regenerate on its own. I'm not going to buy it, but... Well, that seems to stand out. I wonder if it's secretive. Oh, yeah, that's... This is where we're supposed to get our first bit of gear. Right here. Deadly lo 
Avengers. Melee strike range increased by three times? Holy crap! Yes, equip it. Still looks the same. <laughs> Skywalker killing the younglings and we said we're gonna hide the bodies in the snow pile oh so your cult is the cult of the Darth Vader okay <laughs> Everyone get to teleport but me. Why am I unable to turn off this music? Hold and release L2 to create an explosive trap. guy up, don't you, game? For me, you can enjoy Press the rest of your meal. Summon murderous crows. Hold and release to create a nest trap. Press L2 to say yeah, it's the same thing. Um I forgot what I was gonna say. Ow! I shot his freaking hat off! Okay, alright, alright, calm down. How dare you? When I punch you, you die. That's how this works. Can't. You just have to read it. <laughs> Started the idea. The whole reason was to kill the young. What are the younglings? I'm sorry. I I'm. I appreciate the Star Wars franchise, but I'm not what you would consider a Star Wars fan. Um, I've watched one through six. So if, well, no, Anakin's gone by the end of six, I guess. So it wouldn't be past that. What what's a youngling? Dot, dot, dot. 
Oh, his face fell off. <laughs> I love that quote. It makes me giggle. Alright. Burning Halo. 70% chance that a melee target is set ablaze. Victims take 300 damage over 4 seconds. That would be nice if I knew how much 300 damage was. Equip. Oh, you, you just broke it. Awesome. Oh, I remember what I was going to say. Um, I appreciate that they introduced the Vigors, and they kind of gave each of them their own look and um, aesthetic to it. Like, the Plasmids in the other two games were literally just liquid jars. Like, red liquid in jars, sorry. Um, and there wasn't anything to tell you what was inside that plasmid until you injected it into your bones, basically. Um, so I like that they did that with this one. Baby Yoda is a youngling. Younglings are kids being trained, so kids being trained to be a Jedi. Oh, okay. Or was... Are you talking about um, the Mandalorian there, Skip? And it can stop that dream. King Ope. Ope. Sorry, I don't know how to pronounce your name. But I'll just call you King if that's all right. Hello. How are you? You are talking about Mandalorian. Okay. I have not watched The Mandalorian because I am not subscribed to Disney Plus. <laughs> so. Why are we talking about nine inches? I bet I can get to Monument Island from that station. God, that thing is huge. Gondola station. Alright. That's what she said. Uh, potato. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> oh, no worries. Um, this is infinite. The Bioshock infinite. Um, the the third game to be released, but it's technically a prequel. I shall eat your apple. I'll eat more of your apples. Whose home have we invaded here? His eyes were farther apart. Mm -hmm. What color were his eyes? Blue. No, green. I can't remember. His eyes were bigger than that. He's trying to describe me? Okay. Miss, can you recall his hair color? It was... Hmm, red and curly? He looked Irish to me. Yes, like that. Okay, what about his temperament? Oh, he was certainly an anarchist. You can spot them anywhere, you know. Ah! Oh! oh! All right. I'll crush you like a bug. You weren't just on fire. You got incinerated. Like scorpion just throw you through on fire there. Holy crap! All right. I'll clean your clock. I bet you will. Aw, he's heating the room for us. That's nice of him. Ah, uh, we don't need to attack her. Fine, we'll leave you alone. Um, talking about nine inches would be huge. All I heard was nine inches. I don't know what they were talking about. Very old and very... It's not that old. I say, not actually knowing. <laughs> nine, in, nine inches deep? I don't think that's what they were talking about. Um, <laughs> you got a raging three inches. 
<laughs> Don't horrify the new viewer, Skip. <laughs> Is this our exit? Nope. Um, I feel as though I've missed something obvious here. Skeletons, or ash, I guess. Um, you can still loot them. coming. Who told him? Them that sent me here? If so, what's their real game? Dollar bill. Ooh, figure. Fourteen hundred and eighty-five dollars. Oh my god. Devil's Kiss Aid. Adds mini clusters for greater area of effect of damage. Oh, range of damage. Okay. I want to see something. Oh, I see. So they drop money. But that doesn't change the price. Um. I would like to think if I could possess a machine. Ow. How dare you. Um. Oh, okay. I was wrong. Come on, friends. Oh, there you are. Oh. I killed you faster than I thought. Oh, they're staying possessed. That's interesting. Well, I still don't have enough money for the, uh... I 
know you can buy upgrades for your weapons in this game too. I don't. I guess maybe they introduced a third machine for that. More killing. <laughs> Be right back. All right. Panda kills, but he also dies. I haven't died yet, Skip. Sorry to burst the bubble there. Well, unless you actually want to count the baptism and actual drowning. But that's just your word against mine. <laughs> Where is it? Why? Why doesn't this game aim like a traditional fight shooter? Shepherd. Oh, the tower protects the land from the false shepherd. So the lamb is up there to protect her from me. <laughs> Basically. Eat rotten banana. I will take your silver eagle. Alright, I'm gonna stay till like 10.30 just so I can wake up tomorrow. Oh, so another 15 minutes? I forget you're in the time zone behind me. I need to put Doom Eternal in the stream suggestions. Oh, God. <laughs> you know I'm gonna do terribly at that game. Um, yeah, if you want to, go for it. Actually, that's something I wanted to ask you. The DLC's coming out for it soon. Is that something that you want to play? On stream? I get the impression that you probably will play it, regardless of if it's on stream or not. that because of the time or the, 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 the setting like when it takes place um, there's no hacking at all oh the railings we're sorry to say that monument island is off limits you've got to go workmen should proceed to the island by means of the skyline the skylines huh those things them coppers came running in on back by the line I'm sorry, but I feel like if I had the ability to possess this thing, I would do that. The game is just like, nope, you're learning how to ride the rails. Line is the Monument Island with the shaft. Yeah, I get it, Trey Baker. Leave me alone. Um, let me catch up real quick. Um, it's fairly story-based. That's true. There is more of a story than I was expecting, because I did watch you play through it. Um... And there's actually a much more heavy emphasis than I was expecting. Like, I figured that they would create some sort of narrative. But it, it was definitely more than I was expecting. And I'm not completely, like, 
oh, there's no story in it? No. It can't be played. Like, I, I'm not going to shoot anything down like that. Um, otherwise, I wouldn't be taking on your Zelda challenge, right? <laughs> but yeah, if, if you want to see me suffer through that, because you know I'm going to suck at it, um, by all means, throw it on there. <laughs> I'll add it to the list. This, there already is DLC for it. Okay. So, I heard there was one coming up. Is that the one you're talking about? Like, has it already released? I don't have it yet, and I guess it is pretty difficult. I love you suffering. Oh, Skip, you're so sweet. <laughs> All right. Roll the coaster. isn't ruined. You would think that Booker would be like, why is everyone trying to murder me? Ah, uh, shield. Feel better already. Oh, that was... I'm guessing not where I needed to go. Yeah, alright. Onward! Alright. <laughs> I don't know why Buddy didn't shoot me, but I'll take it. Um, just bear in mind too, Skip, that if you do decide to add Doom Eternal to the list, I will be playing FF13 before I play that. Which means I will also be playing FF13 2 and Lightning Returns before that. So, just a heads up. Oh my god, this thing keeps fighting me. Here we go. I don't know, maybe there is another DLC coming. I, I mean, I feel like you would know better than I. I haven't been following Doom Eternal because I haven't played it. I don't own it. I haven't been following up on it. So, you'll do fine as long as you don't pick a high difficulty. I'll be playing whatever the normal is. So, yeah. And I'm sure even at higher difficulties, like... I can usually power through or strategize away through a situation. Um, I just don't feel like it would make for good streaming for me to suffer for an hour. Like, there's some people that you can watch suffer and you want to watch them get through it or you want to watch them rage or whatever, and I don't feel like I'm one of those um, pandas that would be good for that. Just a heads up, you will never beat or best um, FF13. Well, I didn't the last time I played it. <laughs> one of the few games I rage quit. It wasn't really a rage quit, because that implies that I just was stuck on a boss and was just like, Rrr. um, it was more of a lack of patience. The, the game was demanding something of me that I didn't want to do. Um, or it felt like it anyways, which was basically grinding, and I really didn't want to do that. So I said, you know what? The story isn't ca that captivating. I'm moving on. Yui Star. I felt like I pronounced that wrong. Hello, how are you? Battle system in FF13 is so awesome once you get it. I don't think it's that I didn't get it. Um, I think it was just the difficulty spikes. Because I heard that... Um, oh, God. There's this one character. You play as just this guy by himself. He's like a dual-wielding gun character. I don't remember his name at all. And you have to face off against this other... It's, it's fairly early. Like, once this character joins your party, it's not long afterwards that you have to fight this, like, mini-boss or boss character just as him alone. And apparently, if you don't have haste learned by the time you get to this boss, you will not win. I don't know if there's any truth to that or not, or it's just incredibly difficult, like something like that. Um, 
Not going to lie, I'm not a fan of that, if that's the case. And I hear that's not the only situation that's like that in the game. It's just the earliest example of it. It's hard to understand it. Yeah, it'll probably be hard for me once I start it up. <laughs> I don't know. We'll get it. We'll figure it out. Have you beaten it, Skip? The people that watch me for my rage at some points. Slothy, I don't think I've ever actually seen you rage. I think I heard you, like, hardcore re once during Titanfall, and that's about it. <laughs> and the difficulty spikes are definitely real. Yeah, okay. Of course I've beaten it. Well, how dare you don't have faith in me. Oh. And the Lord saw the wickedness of man was great, and he repented he had made man on the earth. Rain. Forty days and forty nights of the stuff. And he left not a thing that walked alive. You see, my friends, even God is entitled to a do-over. And what is Columbia if not another ark for another time? Maybe if I use the control function that's glowing. <laughs> Maybe that'll clear the way. All right, let's get out of here. I should have my shotgun by now. Skyline up above. I got some elevation. Ah, oh, was I not supposed to come down here? Oof. that, obviously. Alright, where am I going? Alright. Here comes the roller coaster ride. Whee! Stand down! Stand down! He who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and the wings <laughs> of angels. Watch over me and lend me strength. Father Washington, Father Washington. Alright, you guys keep praying. Our prophet. Why are they all just letting me go by? I don't understand. I know why you have come, false shepherd. I see every sin that blackens your soul. Wounded me. The Pinkertons, the drink, the gambler, and of course, Anna. And now, to repay a debt, you've come for my land. But not all debts can be repaid, Booker. You don't know me, pal. Prophecy is my business, Mr. As blood is yours. You know why these men will die for them? Because I have seen their future in the glory. And hence they are content. What brought you to Columbia, Booker? 
Bring us the girl and wipe away the debt. This will end in blood. Then again, it always does with you, doesn't it? It always ends in blood. You've come to lead my lamb astray, but thy crook is bent and thy path is twisted. Go back to the Sodom from which you came! Alright. That wasn't creepy in the slightest. Where are we going this way? Let me catch up real quick. I have faith. Me saying you won't beat it is the assumption that you don't have enough faith in yourself. Yeah. Well, if I do it on stream, I have every intention of beating it, so we'll see. I have a feeling, like, with Final Fantasy XV, there was only one stream that I needed to, like, grind, so to speak. And it wasn't even grinding. I was just doing side content for that stream. I feel like I might have to do more grinding for thirteen. And that's my fear. <laughs> <laughs> that one R6 dream R6 that you were there for oh Rainbow Six okay um, I was a second from drop kipping my controller oh, Rainbow Six when did I watch you stream that how long ago was that Slothy <laughs> News to skip, apparently. Um, that must have been a while ago, though, right? It's strange. I don't remember that. Well, I maybe I do. Is that the one where you can, like, board up walls and stuff? A lot of times. I'm nasty at that game. I'm playing it again. Uh, even playing ranked and getting MVP. Wow. Well, I mean, you do play COD. You're used to multiplayer games. All you have to do is really adjust to the idiosyncrasies of whatever game that you've decided to play, and you're probably going to be a beast at whatever, so that makes sense. Long time, I suck. <laughs> hey, if you're having fun, which, I mean, if you're ready to kick the controller, it doesn't sound like you're having fun. R6 is better than COD. I have a feeling that that's just preferential opinion there, Skip. I, I bet that there's some people that would disagree with you. Headshots are one hit. Hitter quitters guaranteed. Uh, I mean, I feel like that that's fair. If you don't like it, don't get shot in the head, right? <laughs> Alright, you can keep doing your thing there, guys. Go back! Holy oh, shit. There he is! These guys aren't terribly difficult. Like, I'm wondering if... I mean, we're still fairly early into the game. I guess I shouldn't sound. Ow! Gotta find the controls to take this thing to Monument Island. Plus, I have an unusually high shield because of that stupid DLC stuff. So that probably made the game easier than it should have as well. I'm still annoyed. But that was a thing. Open the door, yes. The word of the prophet. Okay, I'm sure I can get this thing going. The Lord forgives everything. Oh, there he is. But I'm just a prophet. So I don't have to. <laughs> well, there's sound logic. Jesus! Well, alright then. 
Oh. Oh god! takes far more skill than COD, objectively. Well, I mean, it's headshots are a thing. Like, one-shot kills. Yeah, I believe it. It's been crazy, though, because they changed, like, all the maps, so I'm running around like, I thought there was a fucking door here. <laughs> Gotta change it up on you. Don't be like me with the Lord of the Rings game. In what way? I remember watching you play that, but... What specifically are you referring to there, Sloppy? I'm surprised you haven't played that again since I last saw you. Or maybe you did while I was on holiday. I don't know. I think about it. Uh, oh, we're, we're good on that. I don't need that. And you're still the highly expensive upgrade, so... Welcome to Monument Island. Didn't seem like a place to hold a young girl. What were these people so afraid of? Oh, there it is. Monument Island. Find the girl. Wonder where they got her locked up in this place. For serious injury. Bah. Well, it's close, guys. I guess that's the end of that venture. <laughs> ah, there we go. Oh, it's late. Okay. Because I got cocky, I turned it up to the highest level and pinned it watched me some. Oh, that's what you mean. Yeah. Well, you kept playing with it. Like, you would lower it, and then you realize, no, that's not, that's too easy. So then you would raise it again. Oh, the miniature version of it. Um, yes, I will take the Silver Eagles. Candy bar. Follow mask. I guess even in a restricted area, these crackers need someone to clean the floors. <laughs> Those politicians and scientists don't bother about what they say around me because I'm some half leaded colored boy. But I can tell they scared out of their wits by that thing they got locked upstairs. Yes, sir. They got a tiger by the tail, and they don't know whether to hang on or run. Do not approach this specimen. Are we actually going to meet her already? Yeah, I guess so. Creamy coffee in a can. Why not? Past this point, 72 hour quarantine. Chief Scientist Latisse. Oh, am I going to get another Vigor? Is this the lightning-based one? Transpose number one. Uh, okay. Okay. 
be in the slightest. chair that the I sat on to get up here in the first place. Uh, Mr. Thompson, sir, I, I replaced the entire fuse banker's ass, and the lights were all in working order last night. Last night? There they go again. We go through boxes of fuses every day as of late, and they're just in the siphon alone. I don't... Oh! oh something's happening! What? Oh, ah! I made it. To prevent risk of ex exposure, only operating rooms after soporific has been applied. I struggled with that one. <laughs> That's where I came from, yeah, okay. What in there? Calling her a specimen. Specimen painting. So I guess this is supposed to be a little taste of what this person is like. Give you an idea of what to expect. Singing? Damn, okay, all right. Let's just find her. <laughs> Facility unsafe. It is one thing to imagine one's future, and another to see it. I have seen the seeds of fire that will prepare the Sodom below for the coming of the Lord. But Elizabeth shall sow those seeds, not I. I will fall before the job is done. But she shall take up my mantle. The Lord is calling me home. I feel his love in every tumor because they are the train which takes me to his station. And I go with joy, knowing that Elizabeth will take my earthly place. But the false shepherd is coming to lead my lamb astray. I will not board that train until she is safe from his deceptions. It's 
So as you've noticed, a lot of quarantine notices as we've traveled through this place. Example phrase has been deciphered. Dressing room. That's where we need to go. Unfortunately, nothing is labeled. how we need to lock down for COVID. <laughs> Put mechanical doors on everything. What is wrong with you? Oh my god, that was awesome. <laughs> I wonder if that was in the original version. I don't remember that song playing at all. This game be cray. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. Oh. Get wrecked high. Oh, poor guy. I'm gonna be good night. Alright, Slothy. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you again for the resub. It's hard to believe it's been a year, man. <laughs> Thank you so much for all your support. Um, yeah, I hope you sleep well. Have a good night. Can we go back to the 80s? It's, it looked more fun, didn't it, Petito? <laughs> this job's getting worse all the time. What makes the girl different? I suspect it has less to do with what she is, and rather more with what she is not. A small part of her remains from where she came. It would seem the universe does not like its peas mixed with its porridge. That'll make more sense once you, you know, go through the game more. Sky? Looks like clouds, I guess so. I can do this. 
That's the spirit. Look at this. This is so cool. That looks like something out of God of War 2. Reminds me of the big statue boss at the beginning of the game. Get, you out get of here. away. Are you real? I'm real enough. He's coming. You you've gotta go. Why? You don't want to be here when he gets here. Just a minute, I'm getting dressed. Get you out of here. There's no way out. Trust me, I've looked. Stop it, you're you're too impatient. That's enough. What about this? What about it? This is the way out, isn't it? Sounds disgusting. <laughs> it's his job to keep me locked up in here. Hey, you don't know until you try it. Who are you? Why did you come here? Wait, come on.
your wit! Bring us the curb and wipe away the debt! Are you in there, DeWitt? What do you want with her? We had a deal to win! Tell me what you want with her. Open this door right now! Are you going to hurt her? Tell me what you want! She's humming. Things are looking a little worse around here. Investigations into matters both public and private. Okay. Anna? Anna! I've been told to tell the girl whatever she wants to hear so long as she comes along. That music sounded like FF9. It was so weird. Saved us. Anna. Uh, Anna. No, it's me, Elizabeth. Are you all right? Where am I? Back in the land of the living. Here, let me. I'll be fine. You almost drowned. You need to. I said I'm oh, fine. Just, just, just give me that. <laughs> She's giving me that look. <laughs> Music. Go on, I just. Oh, okay, I, I, I won't be long. I won't be long, Mr. DeWitt. I'm just gonna sleep here on the. I was gonna say ground, but we're in the sky, so I guess it's not accurate to say ground. So apparently a flying city has beaches. Sure, why not? Well, I guess we will have to find... Oh, look at my health. It's so low. I like that they actually changed the health reflective of what just happened in the game. That's cool. Even if it's scripted. Um, but yeah, we are going to call it this evening. Your last checkpoint auto save was on January 5th, 2021, 11.56.20. That's, that's creepy game. <laughs> yes, it's a game. There we go. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, there's only a handful of you in here, and I think you're all looking now, so uh, we're not going to wait tonight. Um... Siren managed to survive the evening, so we will give her her cookies. While we listen to this wonderful music. There we go. Okay, well, thank you for the resubs. Uh, thank you for lurking and hanging out and chatting. Um, I, feel, I felt like this was a great game to start. 2021 with um it'll wrap up the bioshock series as we head into year three so um yeah i hope you guys are enjoying it with me actually you know what no oh, you can't see it you know what i'll check the dlc later um no that's, no no worries welcome back skip um uh, but yeah um we'll be back on thursday with some more bioshock infinite so Till then, have a good evening.